Sports Minute. March 29, 2024, Athlete Spotlight, Walk-Off Win for Warriors, Coaches Depart. Virginia Offensive Coordinator and Tight Ends Coach Day Kitchings was persistent over the last five to six months, Berkeley Prep, Tampa, Tight End Justin Zams said. Football Virginia Football Notes Junior Wilson trying to build off of his best offseason during spring practice Greg Maddia football I definitely missed it, Virginia safety Antonio Clary returns to practice after an ankle injury sidelined him last season Greg Maddia. According to Zams, a recruiting target of Kitchings, the Cavaliers assistant would call once or twice a week to check in with the tight end. And through their conversations, the two cultivated trust with one another so much so that Sam said one of the top reasons he committed to Uva last week was because of his bond with Kitchings. It's been great to build a relationship with him, Sam's, a 6 foot 4, 237 pounder, said. It means a ton because it shows that the coaching staff and him, specifically, Zams continued, actually care about you as a person and not just who is going to win you games. And winning games is the most important thing, but it's nice to know that the coach also cares about you as a person and is there for you. That feeling is a good feeling to have. Zams visited Uva for a spring practice last week ahead of committing, when he became the Hoofs' sixth pledge in their 2025 recruiting class. So, I was able to meet all the coaches and I got a great feel for the program, Zams said. But I love that the coaches and one of the main things I noticed is that they had attention to detail during practice, which I loved because they focus on the little things with the players. He said he was able to see how Kitchings, Zams' future coordinator and position coach, operates with players and uses tight ends within the offense as well. They ran a lot of 11 and 12 personnel, Zams said, and I love to see that as a tight end, obviously. And having Coach Kitchings be the OC and tight ends coach gives me the best of both worlds there. Zams said this past fall he was primarily a blocking tight end for state champion Berkeley Prep which upset national power Miami Norland in the Class 2M title game in Tallahassee. But Sam said he can be a blocking and receiving threat, and Duva believes that, too. I view myself as a very balanced tight end, Sam said. On my tape, it's blocking because we run the ball a lot and I feel like I do an incredible job of blocking, but I view myself as a balanced tight end with the ability to be influential in the receiving game as well as being a good blocker. He said while in Charlottesville at the Cavaliers practice last week, he was able to get a sense for what they ask of their tight ends blocking in Kitching's wide zone running scheme as well as how they used in the passing game.